Today on Globe News, inclusive restrooms where students can find deals on computers and more, and art and film on campus. Keep watching, Globe News starts now. Welcome to Globe News, I'm Marcus Webster. And I'm John Coles. First, on today's episode, SLCC Student Association spearheaded a pilot program to start making restrooms on campus more inclusive. The restroom signage program debuted last September in the Taylorsville Redwood Campus Student Center. The current signage has unique features consisting of multicolored diamonds and a message that encourages anyone to use the restroom that aligns with their gender identity and expression. In addition to the signage on current restrooms in the Student Center, the college plans to renovate an existing restroom to be gender inclusive restroom. The timeline and location have not yet been determined, but the renovation may likely be in the Student Center. To read the full story, visit globeslcc.com. SLCC's Surplus Store offers students used computers, laptops, and much more for low prices. For students, I think it's a very valuable service because it is a way to get much needed materials, such as a computer, for far less cost than trying to buy new or get scammed by somebody that doesn't want to listen to the needs of the student. Some items the surplus store offers include Dell laptops for as low as $40, Mac computers for $230, and keyboards for 50 cents. The best way to find out what's in stock is to go to the warehouse or call ahead and ask. The surplus store is located at 2675 South and 900 West. The sales floor is open from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Monday through Friday. For more information, go to slcc.edu slash surplus. Let's check in with Marcus at the calendar to see what's, going, what's happening on campus. Thanks, John. Spring may have not yet sprung here in Utah, but it's already time to start thinking about summer. <clears throat> summer registration is now open, and fall registration will begin on April 10th. Register early to be sure and get the classes you need to graduate. Making an appointment with an advisor can also ensure registering for the right classes to complete a degree. In honor of Women's Heritage Month, Somos Mas is highlighting eight Afro-Latina women across many industries. This ongoing display goes through March 13th in the West Hallway of the Student Events Center at the Taylorsville Redwood Campus. For more events happening on campus, go to globeslcc.com calendar. Back to you, John. Student art will also soon be on display on campus. The Visual Art and Design Department began accepting submissions for the 2023 SLCC Student Art Showcase on March 1st. The annual exhibition invites current students to submit their best work for consideration. Students may submit up to four works. Submissions close at 11.59 p.m. on March 13th and will be juried prior to inclusion in the showcase and may not be included. Professionals, instructors, or non-students are not eligible for consideration. For more information, visit slcc.edu slash visualarts. Since January, the Spring Film Series has been screening a curated selection of films at South City Campus, which have included independent projects and documentaries. Up next is the 1950 classic, Harvey. Catch the film at South City Screening Room on March 14th. The show starts at 6 p.m. and is free and open to the public, no tickets required. Following Harvey's showing, the series will screen Side by Side and Waiting for Guffman on March 21st and 28th before finishing the series with Samsara on April 18th. Uh, we, have, we have a great discussion every time. Uh, it's, it's incredible to see uh, all the different perspectives that people bring. Most of the time when we go to films, we you know, go to a theater and we have a conversation with the, the person that we're with and we may talk about it in the car or something like that. But uh, this gives us an opportunity to actually like break it down and discuss what the film meant and uh, how the film impacts society and uh, are we making films like this anymore and some things like that. So we tend to have some really cool discussions. That's it for this episode of Globe News. To watch this episode and past episodes of Globe News, go to globeslcc.com or find us on Facebook slash SLCC SMC or on Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube at SLCC SMC. I'm John Coles. And I'm Marcus Webster. Thanks for watching Globe News. Mm -hmm.